The gender gap starts young. Between ages 9 and 11, two-thirds of kids draw men to represent scientists. By year 4, only 33% of girls are confident in their math skills. Despite similar average results in NAPLAN, fewer girls achieve the top scores. At 15, 33% of girls don't think maths is useful to further study. And 24% don't think maths can help them get a job. In Year 12 Physics, girls are outnumbered 3 to 1 by boys. Now, only 16% of STEM professionals are women. That means fewer scientists, engineers and mathematicians. Fewer academics. Fewer world-defining change makers are women. So the cycle continues but there's a solution. If we can inspire confidence in girls to overcome their obstacles, encourage everyone to think differently about STEM stereotypes, and redefine what the STEM workforce should look like, then we'll be recruiting more scientists engineers, more mathematicians, more academics, and more world-defining change makers to join the fight against the world's greatest problems and create a sustainable future.